Hi everybody, this is Connie, and I'm sorry I didn't do my get ready with me. Uh, I was halfway through it and realized my uh, camera had shut off. So what I'm going to do is just tell you what I've got on my face, and that'll be it for today. Um, first thing I did was um, wear my uh, Physician's Formula Cushion Foundation in Light. It's really pretty. It is dried out though. So those of you that still are on the fence about these, don't waste your money. You know, they're great at first, but they don't last. Um, I had to throw away my, uh, was it Maybelline? One. And now I'm going to throw this one away. Because they're, it's, it's almost completely dried out. I did get enough to do my face. But it is... A very dry it's almost like a powder foundation now so this is going in the garbage as soon as I take a picture <laughs> I always forget to do that I did not wear primer today I did not wear an eye primer because as soon as I I'm done filming for the day all this is going off so um, I wore for my uh, concealer I wore my Neutrogena healthy skin 3-in-1 concealer for eyes in fair and that's that so many of my things are getting so old I need to replace a lot of them but you know how that goes uh, I'm wearing my Milani easy brow in natural taupe today and it's it's a little blonde but um, I figured out that, you know, if you push a little bit harder, it gives you more color. So I really, I'm really falling in love with this. I like this Milani, and I would repurchase. If they had a soft brown, I would get that instead. But um, if they don't, then I would go with the, the taupe again. Uh, let's see. For my eyes today, I wore my Morphe 25A. It is the Copper Spice Palette. And I wore, this is my base, I wore this as my transition, this in my outer V, and I wore this all over my eye, and this one here I wore in my inner corner. So I'll let you see, very pretty um, fall colors. Okay, so then I used, for my eyebrow, or my eyeliner, I used the um, Shella, 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 I don't know how they pronounce it. Uh, Hello Beautiful Eyes, it says. It's an indigo blue, and I thought it was a little bit too bright, so I kind of covered it a little bit with more eyeshadow. And it's got a felt tip pen, and it's okay. I'm not a huge fan of felt of um, liquid eyeliners, so I thought I'd try it though. And I wore my Better Than Sex Mini Mascara Deluxe Sample Size Mascara. I love this. By the way, I did not do my bottom waterline. I am figuring out that as I age, it makes my eyes look smaller, and I've got pretty good size eyes, and it makes my eyes look squinty when I'm wearing it on the bottom. So I'm not going to do that anymore. Uh, blush. I'm wearing my Morphe 9N palette, my blush palette. And I wore this today. I don't use this real often because it is super, super powdery. Really powdery. For my highlighter today, I'm wearing my new Becca highlighter in Prosecco Pop. And I'm not a huge fan of gold highlighters, but it's still very pretty. I could use this in my um, inner corner of my eyes, or I could use it for my eyeshadow if I decide I don't want to use it on my cheeks. And I used a pretty light hand, and boy, is it ever showing up. Okay, and for my lipsticks, <laughs> I, I wore a red um, lip liner, and then I put... Uh, if I can find it now, 
for crying out loud. I just put it in here. The Star Wars lipstick in number 30. And it was it was as dark as it was last week. And I did not want the same color on my lips. So I took it off. And so I have no makeup around my mouth. <laughs> so anyway, what I decided to wear was the only one by Rimmel. In 300 Listen Up. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry about the get ready with me this week. And that's my makeup of the day anyway. So I'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.